Welcome everyone to my art room. Today in this video, I'm going to do a pseudo swipe. I'm going to swipe my colors with cell activator and I'm going to do it on two uh, four by four tiles, ceramic tiles to make a matching pair and it's going to be, I'm going to try and do negative space. So stick around and we'll get right to it. Okay, let's get started doing this pseudo swipe. So I've got a little tile here and I've poured some paint down and I'm gonna stretch it out a little closer to the edge. I probably will tilt it, so. It's my um, eggshell house paint. Okay, I'm going to start with uh, Red Violet. This is by Amsterdam. And I'm just going to do a little one because I'm just, I don't want to make it a big, just want a lot of negative space too. So, and this is a uh, plum deco art. And then I have some uh, Deep Yellow by Arteza. Just drizzle it on. It doesn't have to be a lot, whatever you think. You want it enough to cover a lot of the white, obviously. So. Okay, now I have Prussian Blue, which is my cell activator, mixed with my Aussie Floetrol. I've got a card that I've cut. So I'm gonna, you can see that I'm gonna put some paint on my card. Just a little bit on the edge like that. And I'm just gonna swipe. Do the middle first, I guess. I'm gonna wipe it. Wow, that's pretty. Whoa, look at those colors. do any more I might just tilt this right now let's let it sit for a minute let the cells develop because I do want some negative space I like that one right there see if I can show you closer I love this part right here and that okay well we're gonna tilt it whoops maybe I'll go this way first You know what, there's a paint that I'm not happy with lately. This red violet one by Amsterdam. It seems to look at, I really don't like this. So I'm gonna do another one and take that color out. 
I don't know what it is. Must maybe it's bad the paint. I've never had that happen before. So I will not be using that one again. See how it's funny there. Well, it's a shame to waste all this paint. So what I think I'm going to do. Um, well, I think I'm going to have to scrape it because if I want negative space, I don't want all that paint on there. A little technical difficulty there. My battery was going low. Okay. So I've scraped this tile and I'm gonna eliminate the red violet. And I think maybe I'll add the blue instead. This is the Prussian blue. Oh, oh silly me. I forgot to put my pillow down. <laughs> See what happens when you get interrupted? By technical difficulties. Okay, so that's pretty good. It's quite spread out. There's quite a lot of paint on here. Try and get it to the edge as you can. It's close because it's going to be pulled off and tilted, so... Okay. Start this again. Prussian blue. is a plum deco art. I'm going to put a bit more of the lighter. This is a um, deco art metallic. Extreme Sheen. Lavender Frost. And then a Prussian Blue. And then the yellow is Arteza Deep Yellow. I'm going to swipe with uh, this is Payne's Gray with Amps with Australian Floetrol. How deep that is. There's a lot of black there left. I'm going to go across that. That's beautiful there. I think that's it. I'm not going to do any more. I'm going to just tilt this because I want to have some negative space. Tilt it in my messy tray. Oh, and don't drop it. This is slippery things. I'm going to get this off a bit here. I don't want to tilt too much of that off. I'm going to leave that white. Is that 
don't like this, so I'm tilting that off. Just gonna bring this back. Tilt it that way a little bit. And I go back this way. Get most of that off that I didn't care for. A bit more. Okay, now I'm going to come back this way. It's looking pretty. was hoping for more white space on the other side but that's okay let's see how, see how this goes maybe I won't I get this off All right, let's use the same colors again, maybe in a different order. So this time, whoop, there we go again. Almost forgot my pillow. I think I'll start with this darker purple. It's a um, plum deco art. I'll do the dark, I think. And then the yellow. Oh, that's a lot of yellow. Okay. I'm swiping with the Amsterdam or the Prussian Blue by Stevenson. It's the only Prussian Blue that I had. So, works fine. Oh, sorry, not Prussian Blue. This is Payne's Gray. What am I saying? Okay. Beautiful Payne's Gray has a bluish tinge to it. Whoa. 
that is gorgeous. I think I'm going to just take a smaller one. Just see if I can... Oh, I think I need to cut it. I just want to do down the side of that one. Now, this totally looks same colors, but they're going to look so different because of a different order of paints. So, let's tilt this. I'm going to go this way first. I was going to leave some of that, but... Bring it back to the middle. I'm going to go this way. Not sure how much weight I'm going to have left, but I actually wanted to get that off. So Go down this way. I don't think I'm going to take any more white off. some of that off. Oh, I hope you were on camera there. Sorry. Get so involved in what I'm doing, I forget what camera I'm on. These are smaller cells, but they're pretty. I'll go this way a little more. Don't like this here. Looks green. Okay, I'm coming back. Well, blue and yellow make green, so you're bound to get some green if I got yellow and blue in there. It's amazing how I used a dark cell activator. Most of them are covered in dark, 
And these look like they're rings of white inside the black. Really nice. Okay, I think that's it. I think I, I want to stop. Hold it up. See if I can, actually I'll put it over here and you can see both. Move this out of the way. Move this ahead a bit so you can see. I think we're just going to take my gloves off. They're too full of paint. So they're the same colors. Just hope you don't drop them. So I think they'll make a nice coaster set. I can zoom you down. Let's see if I can move this camera a bit back that way. There. Pretty. Pseudo swipe on a tile. Thanks for watching. These will be dried at the end of the video. I'll show you what they look like dried. And then one day I will resin them. But I love them. They're awesome. See you in the end of the video. And at the end of the video, when you see the dried results, there will be some drop downs and it will show you some playlists that you can see more pseudo swipes. Okay? Have a good day. Hi, everyone. So here's my dried tiles that I did the pseudo swipe matching pair with a bit of negative space. I just love how it turned out. I did the exact same colors but in different orders and they came out pretty close. I love them. So I think I'll resin these. Such vibrant colors. Very smooth, right? So smooth. Pretty, pretty. Gotta love the swipe. All right. Come back to my art room and I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye.